as a friend, colleague, um, he'll be missed. You know, this took a long time for me to write. Um, <clears throat> part of it is thanking him, <clears throat> thanking his family for sharing him with us. Um, other parts of it will be what I've already mentioned, his dedication to the job. Uh, the fact that it was a huge part of his life. And um, I'll be talking a little bit about his involvement with search and rescue and the fact that he, he focused on, on our young adults, um, which are high school age young men and women. Uh, he was very compassionate, very understanding, and uh, in all, uh, he was a teacher. Uh, I was involved with him in search and rescue for six years, and he was very engaged one-on-one -on -one with the police. And they went to him. Uh, he gave a lot of guidance. He did a lot of one-on-one -on -one counseling. Uh, not just the teaching. Uh, he became very close to all of them, year after year. And he stayed with it. Um, I'll be talking about that. I'll be talking about his dedication, his strength, uh, his compassion. But I think most of all, what I, I will comment on is his conviction of heart. Uh, that's who he was. Uh, I'll miss him. Uh, a lot of us here will miss him. Uh, Eric uh, was so well known that I've gotten more emails, cards, and letters from the other sheriffs around the state, from their staff. Uh, from other agencies, um, it was surprising how far he'd reached out and how many people actually knew him. And uh, a lot of them will be here. There isn't any agency that isn't or hasn't been partly involved in putting this together. So it's 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 very important for the family, and it's very important for us as an agency. And I think it's very important for the community. A lot of community members have expressed their sympathies and their support for the family and for 